We've started this year in the midst of a crisis unlike any that we've seen in our lifetime. Last month, we lost more than half a million jobs, a total of nearly 2.6 million in 2008. Another 3.4 million people who want and need full-time work have had to settle for part-time jobs. With each passing day, families here in Ohio and across America are watching their bills pile up and their savings disappear. And economists from across the political spectrum tell us that if nothing is done and we continue on our current path, this recession could linger four years and America could lose the competitive edge that has served as the foundation for our strength and our standing in the world. Now, it's not too late to change course, but only if we take dramatic action as soon as possible. The way I see it, the first job of my administration is to put people back to work and get our economy moving again. That's why I've moved quickly to work with my economic team and leaders of both parties on an American recovery and reinvestment plan that will immediately jumpstart job creation and long-term growth. And I'm pleased that Congress has seen the urgency as well and is moving quickly to consider such a plan. It's a plan that will create or save three to four million jobs in businesses large and small across a wide range of industries. And 90 percent of these jobs will be in the private sector. I want to be clear, we're not looking to create just any kind of jobs here. We're looking to create good jobs that pay well and can be shipped overseas. Jobs that don't just put people to work in the short term, but position our economy to be on the cutting edge in the long term. 